everybody, this is Judy at Judy in the Kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to cook millet. Now the general rule of thumb when you're cooking millet is to use one part of millet to two parts of water or broth and we want to bring that liquid to a boil. Now in the meantime you want to rinse and drain your millet really well so I have done that here. Now some people like to soak their millet for whatever amount of time. It is not mandatory that you soak millet uh, and you can if you want to but I opt not to bother with that. So anyway it's rinsed and it's draining and when this water comes to a boil then we'll go from there. Well that did not take long and you see my water is boiling so we are going to just add that millet right in there. I'm going to give it a little stir and then we're going to put the lid back on. I'm going to lower the heat to a medium low, okay? We just want this to simmer. I'm going to set the timer for 20 minutes. All right, as you can hear, my timer has just gone off. It's been 20 minutes. I'm turning the heat off right now and I'm not going to lift the lid. I'm going to set the timer again for five minutes. Stove is off, timer set for five minutes. We're just going to leave this alone and let it rest for five minutes and that will give the uh, millet a chance to absorb any more liquid that happens to be in the pan and then we'll fluff it up and show you what it looks like. All right, now you can see I'm just going to fluff it with a fork and we're going to put some in a dish so you can see what it looks like. Here we go. It is completely cooked and ready to serve and do anything you want to do with this. You can eat it like a breakfast porridge. You can substitute this for another cooked grain in any recipe that calls for rice or couscous or quinoa or anything like that. You can use it as a side dish in place of potatoes. Uh, you can include it in some baked goods. You can do a lot with the millet. Well, let me know if you have any questions or comments. This is Judy at Judy in the Kitchen. I hope this helps. Bye for now.